we're on the train now just waiting to um, anchor up and then we'll be off we should be in France in about 25 minutes signing out alright guys uh, just an update um, we're actually in St Quinton at the moment uh, this is our second night uh, just to update you um, we set off from home and we went to Harrogate on the A1 uh, M1, A1M1 whatever it was uh, and straight down uh, to Cambridge at Cambridge we stayed um, on a CL uh, it was like a farm a nice field and that that cost us seven uh, pounds we then uh, crossed the tunnel to Calais um, and then from Calais we drove uh, all the way down to uh, near St Quentin um, I'll, I'll, um, I'll show you um, on the on the map uh, so what happened was we went from Calais um, and, and we're now at, at um, number 67 now all these numbers yeah, uh, are free campsites or, or very small campsites the one at number 67 um, if you actually look in uh, in the book here they've all uh, they're all different uh, things that's eastern France um, and, and this is the Champagne region um, and, and then what you do you look at the number number one number two number three and it tells you what's available and how much it is we actually uh, have paid five pounds for the night um, uh, five euros I should say uh, which is okay uh, it's a nice place we've had a walk down the side of the canal uh, there's not much here to be fair um, to get here up to now we've spent about £100 in diesel uh, and like I say um, we've probably spent near enough uh, 18 quid on, on food uh, that was after the shop that we had um, and we're heading um, to uh, we decided we, we were just looking on the uh, on the map and we're heading, heading to a place called uh, Troy's now that's going to take us again another few hours uh, but we're staying on a proper campsite hopefully tomorrow now we haven't booked it we're just going to go there it looks quite nice and Troy's as a town looks really nice everyone's sat outside these bars that sort of thing so we're going to spend two nights there so we've got a full day we're going to have a running on on the bike into the town uh, and we'll do a video from there this is a video just telling you, um, you know, the way we came. Uh, we didn't go on motorways, we went on A roads, uh, the A1 uh, and the A25. Uh, and we've not had to pay any tolls up to now, so that's the reason why we've done it. Um, so we're going to try and find nice villages on the way. So I'll keep you posted on that and we'll do a proper vlog um you know when we get settled but like i say we, we we've camped up here we filled up with water you've got toilet facilities where you can empty your toilet and um you know for five euros you can't go wrong really so uh, so that's where we're at at the moment i'll i'll keep you posted and i'll get you in uh, in the second video see you then bye right we've um, just parked up um Okay, it's chilled out. The sun's just gone in. It's absolutely mad out. It's 28 degrees. Um, there is other people here, and this little bit where we are. It's got a swimming pool. Um, not the best site I've been in, but it's um, it, it's it's okay. It's got you know it's got all the amenities. Uh, 52 euros was it? 52 or 54? It's round there, I don't know, 52 or 54 euros. Nights. Um, and that's for two nights. So this is going to be our break, really, because we, we want to go into Troyes. Oh. Twa. Huh? Pronounce twa. I'll twa you in a minute. <laughs> anyway, uh, that's where we're at at the moment, so it's just a quick video for that. All right. I'm all sweaty. <laughs> right, we're just oh having God. lunch. I'm all uh, sweaty. 
We're having lunch in the square. Uh, we're still at um, where's this Troy's? No. Where is it? Cat. Cat. What are you talking about? Cat. That's where we are. Cat. It's not. It's Troy's. No, it's Twat. Cat. Twat. No, Twat. Well, where's cats come no, from? Twa, I meant twa. Eh? I meant twa. You daft twa. <laughs> <laughs> Just walking back now to our motorhome after being out and having a lovely day in the town, which was about a nice 15 20 minutes walk. Had a beautiful lunch, so we're absolutely stuffed now and just ready to plonk out on them deck chairs. So, just been to Aldi to top up the fridge. So, back to where we are. Uh, Max, yes. Hi guys, just a, a quick update on the travel scenario. Uh, we're doing different videos. This one's just about where we've stayed, how much it's cost, what, which route we've took. So, you've seen the first one. Uh, I'll just recap on that uh, as I show you the map, uh, and I'll just point out where we've, where we've, uh, where we're up to, where we're going, um, and then obviously. Um, Okay, we'll do some of the videos of the places that, that we're at. So, um, this is just showing you uh, uh, obviously what's what. So, <clears throat> I'll finish this video in, I'll do it in two so you can see the map as well. So, just bear okay. with me. Okay, so um, we started off at Calais, um, we ended up near St. Quentin on number 67. We then um, carried on down uh, to um, where we are now which is Troy's now so far we've kept off the motorway so we've not paid any tolls now what we have to do now we're going to head in towards Dijon and then we're going to carry on uh, further down towards Macon which is which is here and then if we turn this over to the south side of the, the thing which you've got uh, Dijon there then you've got uh, Macon uh, there and we're going to try to end up at Leon. Uh, now that's the plan uh, tomorrow. Uh, we are going to go on the motorways and uh, we are going to pay a toll because it saves us four hours. We're trying to get down south now as, as fast as we can. We've had a break, we've, we've had a walk into town. Um, so, you know, we want to do a bit of travelling tomorrow. Now, just so you know, um, this, uh, this map is where all the airs are. These are the, the free ones or, or the very uh, cost effective um, stopovers which all these numbers, you can see them all, there's, there's hundreds and hundreds of them. Uh, it's on a first come first, first serve basis. They usually cost either free or up to five euros around that, that figure um, and, and it's great as a, an overnight uh, stop. Some of them you won't like so you just move on to the next one some of them are full uh, again you look for the next one uh, and some of them are fantastic uh, so you know it, it's um, it, you get what you get at the end of the day but you know for five euros compared to this campsite where we're on now at 54 euros uh, there's a big difference the, di the, the only thing is with this one is we wanted the security while we went into town today and had a break so that's the reason why Anyway, I'll do another video yeah, so next. So it's, it's cost uh, 150 uh, pounds in diesel so far. Uh, I'm averaging uh, 28 and a half miles per gallon, uh, which is pretty good for this thing. Um, I'm surprised we're going through a little bit of gas, to be honest with you, and I think it's because I'm not having electric. 
The reason why I'm not having electric is I don't want to pay for it. There's no need to pay for it. The solar panel's fantastic. I wouldn't do without a solar panel. Uh, the satellite, waste the time, I wouldn't bother with that. But my Wi-Fi, I've got to have my Wi-Fi. I, I'm watching all my catch-up on there later on at night. I'll watch the suits and stuff before I go to sleep in bed. Um, so so that's the main thing to have is, is the the the, um, the Wi-Fi and also the solar panel. It would be a good idea to have two solar panels um, because it charges your battery up a lot quicker but I've not had any problems. Now the gas, uh, I've got the refillable gas but uh, I've not got an adapter for France because I thought having double the amount of gas on board would last us at least a month because the smaller tank that I had lasted us nine months, at least nine months and wasn't empty. But we do seem to be going through gas uh, quite a bit looking at the gauge. So it's something just to bear in mind. So tomorrow we've got a, a big day. We've got probably five hours uh, driving, maybe six hours. But we are going to go on the motorway, pay the toll, because I think when I worked it out going on the A roads, it was another four hours. So we're going to cut out four hours just by paying the tolls and going on the motorway. So tomorrow, full belt, down on the motorway as far as we can. Uh, we're going to get another airs overnight, not a campsite. Uh, and airs, you've got your water, you can empty your toilet, and it's just an overnight stay, really. Um, so you know it, it's not going to cost in fact i think the, the next few are free they're all free you don't pay for anything uh so they're good for that uh whereas the campsite's been good for security so that we locked up the motor home and then we've gone into town and then come back so um you know that's good uh one of the main things i've, I've got on on the um on the motor home which is vital is a watering can because if you want to top up your water you just go to the tap fill it up come back and you've got a at least a gallon of um, of water to to go back into the uh, system it saves you having to drive over to where the motor homes go to empty your water to put water in you only do that when you arrive uh, or when you leave him and it'll last you two to three days um, <clears throat> so topping it up on the way is a great idea so that I've used more than anything, you know, just for topping up uh, the water, making sure we've got enough on board because we're constantly having showers on board. The campsite's okay uh, where we are, but the toilet facilities are not the best. Uh, we prefer to use our own um, and we prefer to use our own showers, so uh, that's where we're at with that one. Uh, so it is important that when you get a motor on that the shower uh, is good. Uh, to go really in, in your motor home. Um, so that's it for now. So I'll keep you posted on the update of the travel uh, and we'll keep you posted on the, the videos of where we've been. Don't forget, we don't know where we're going. We're just going through these places and um, you, you know, we're just seeing what it's like and, and, and um, just doing a video on it. Um, one thing is Leon, we've looked on the forums and a lot of people are saying that Leon being a big place, Muslim place, be very careful because a few people have had uh, problems with break-ins of their vehicles, stuff like that. So we're going to camp outside of Leon, uh, or, or even if we can get further down, like I said, uh, we're going to get an airs, um, and if we can get into one of these cities or towns, we're going to go on the moped. Today we actually walked in because it was only a mile, so... Anyway, I'll let you go. Uh, like I say, I'll send some more videos in a bit. So that's where we're at on the uh, on the travel. Cheers, then. Bye.